do is we're going to take using what's called dynamic tape, which has got this Maori print on it. The difference between this tape and sort of K tape, which is traditional tape that everyone uses, is this is multi-directional and it also has a massive recoil. So whereas K tape doesn't it has an end range, whereas this doesn't. So what we're going to do is we're going to help tape his calf to take the load off his calf. Uh, it's also very smooth and very skin-like, and also it's waterproof and it's um, a massive. Imp could use as a decelerator or accelerator of muscular movement. So it's quite quite biomechanical in origin. So what we're going to do, we're going to put his ankle into um, plantar flexion. So we're going to, we can access this gastroc here. We're going to start by putting the tape on the bottom of the uh, heel. So this is really good for sort of Achilles problems, plantar fascia problems, tendinopathies. So I've put a bit of pre-tape or um, pre-spray application. I'm just going to load it up the base of his leg but not too much stretch at all, and just lower that down. But what, what the clever thing you can do with this is you get two strips here, and you can pick up the gastroc and, and offload that, so it helps when he's running the marathon. So we, again, tape, pull tape in the middle. Again, lay one side down, and then carefully grab all the tissue, Pull the tape across, and that's going to offload. A bit of heat application because it's heat applicated glue, a bit like K tape. Dynamic tape starting to come over to the UK, but it's pretty slow at the moment. But we're, I'm starting to experiment in the, the clinic with it. So I grab the tissue, pull it across, and lay that down. And you can see that he's got that little bit of recoil there. It's